What is going on ladies and gentlemen, Ken or Wiltshire here and welcome to my tutorial on how to correct the color in your Call of Duty gameplay. However, before I get into the tutorial, let me tell you what you're going to need in order to follow this tutorial. You're going to need an HD PVR to record the video, and a PC or Mac with the programs Adobe After Effects and or Adobe Premiere Pro. If you do not have After Effects nor Premiere Pro, I have linked the trial versions for both programs in the description below. You will need to create an account in order to download the trial versions. With that said, let's move on to the tutorial. I have taken the liberty of creating two parts to this tutorial showing you how to color correct in After Effects and Premiere Pro. Please click on the program button that you are most familiar and comfortable with using. It will take you to the start point of either the After Effects method or the Premiere Pro method depending on which button you have clicked. Come on, click a button. Any button. Now that we're on the After Effects startup page, we're going to go over and start a new composition. The width and height should be 1280 by 720. Assuming that you're using an HD PVR, if you're using a different capture card, make sure you adjust these settings accordingly to what your card outputs. And the pixel aspect ratio should be square pixels. The frame rate should be 59.94. And once you have those settings set, we can click OK. And onto the left here in our project box, we want to right click, go to import, and hit file. And we're going to import the video that we want to color correct. Now that After Effects has imported our video, we want to click and drag this video all the way down to the timeline, and it will load our video into the video preview. Now it's ready to have effects applied to it. To apply effects, you need to go over to the right here and go to the Effects and Presets tab. If you don't have this tab, go to the Window tab and go to Effects and Presets, or you can hit Control 5 on your keyboard. And the effects that we want to apply to our video are under the Blur and Sharpen tab and the Color Correction tab. First, we're going to apply a sharpen effect and we can just click and drag the effect onto our video and it will load a control for effects over on the left where our project box was and we can adjust our settings here accordingly to what we want and the last effect that we want to apply to our video is brightness and contrast so again click and drag it onto your video and the settings that I recommend for sharpen is roughly about 10 and the brightness I recommend to be about negative 9 and the contrast to be about uh, 11 to 12. And as you can see the video got a little bit darker and it got a little bit sharper. Now if I move over to the video a little bit you can see that it looks a little bit better. Now I'm going to take the effects off and I'm going to put them back on so you can see an example of what it looks like with the effects on and off. There will also be an example video of this video playing at the end of this uh, tutorial. So here is what the video looks like without the effects on and here is what the video looks like with the effects on. It looks a little bit better than it did before. That's how you color correct your Call of Duty gameplay in Adobe After Effects. Now that we're on Premiere Pro startup page, you want to go and start a new project. Now you can name this project whatever you like, but I'm just going to leave it as Untitled. And for the video settings, and I'm assuming that you're using an HD PVR, the settings for the HD PVR should be 59.94 frames per second. The frame size should be 1280 by 720. The pixel aspect ratio should be 1 or square pixels. And make sure you have these two checkboxes checked off. And if you're using a different capture card, make sure you adjust these settings to whatever the capture card outputs. With that said, we can click OK. And it will now load Premiere Pro's interface. And we want to go to the left here in our project box here and we'll right click and go to import. And we're going to import the video that we want to color correct. And now that Premiere Pro has imported our video, we want to click and drag this into the timeline. And it will load our video into the video preview. Next we're going to apply the effects for color correction and you can find that in the effects tab over here but if you don't have that tab go to the windows tab at the top and check make sure that effects is checked off or you can hit shift plus seven in the keyboard as a shortcut. So we want to go underneath the video effects tab and the blur and sharpen tab and we want to grab the sharpen effect and we want to drag and drop this onto our video on the timeline and now it's applied to our video. Next we want to go to the color correction tab and we want to get brightness and contrast and just drag that onto our video. Next we want to change the values of our effects at the top here and you can find this by just going to the audio mixer or just clicking left on the tabs here and you'll get to 
effects controls but if you don't have that again go to the windows tab and make sure effects controls is checked off or just plus shift plus five in your keyboard so for the sharpen i recommend about 10 is the value and for brightness i recommend about negative nine around that area and brightness 11 to 12 so i'm gonna put 12. and that is how you color correct your video in premiere pro